for me, uh, why I, I took an HIV test is because uh, I first felt I was at risk. Secondly, I felt uh, I needed to know my status um, just for the purposes of my own knowledge and to know whether uh, what steps to take, um, whether I need to be on drugs or in any case of anything. I wanted to know what I need to do. I don't think I need to know. I don't think I have AIDS. Living with people who have HIV and being in contact with them, relating with them, does not bring any negative effect to us, but instead it helps us to um, be an encouragement to them. For example, I had an uncle who passed away, but our being close to him helped him to carry on. HIV is not a problem in Nigeria. I don't know of Africa, but Nigeria as a whole, HIV is not a problem. It is, it is, and it's, it's ravaging, it's ravaging the youth, it's ravaging the elderly, it's ravaging the young ones. It's a problem, it's an issue. I'm a widow and I don't meet men again. I don't go about again, I'm on my own, so I don't believe I can have it. And I'm a Christian, I pray. I believe that God will not even allow me to have such thing. It was during my wife's delivery. She called me from Seguela. I was in doubt, but she encouraged me. She told me that she had been tested and that it worked, and that she had not contracted AIDS. She encouraged me to go for testing, which I did. I got tested, and since then, my wife and I go for testing every three months. I don't know anyone with HIV. But since I work within the health sector, I got to learn about ARVs through the public health pharmacy. And I know that with them, an infected person can live as comfortably as they wish. As long as they take the treatment, they can live. I have a friend who's living with the virus. And it's only because of her parents and advice from friends that she has the morale to live normally like the rest of us. She's not sick, but she carries the virus. tested for HIV and AIDS? Yes. Why did you feel the need or why did you think it's, it's important for you to go and test? I mean just to know your status, to feel relieved that you know where you're standing. Well quite frankly I've never been tested for HIV and AIDS because I'm quite scared but at the same time I know I protect myself in all kinds of ways and I abstain. I do abstain. <laughs> Actually, I've been persuaded to do so, but I failed enough to duck the courage to do so because I sometimes feel it's not good to know there is something which I've got in my body killing. I haven't tested. I'm married to one man for 45 years and never had sex with other men. I'm a loyal woman, so I didn't test, but I know there are tests and I believe it's very important. avoid going to the hospital or clinic for an HIV test. But what would you do if those carrying out the test came to your house? The Kenyan government recently launched a door-to-door -door testing campaign and here's how people in the country are reacting to the program. In the small village of Asega in Rift Valley, Kenya, life is slow and newcomers are rare. So when these health workers came here recently, there was a lot of curiosity. They are here to test residents for HIV AIDS as part of an ongoing government initiative. Most people in Asega are farmers and